And a energy sem ni say, tap tap send si yen fa sad de rowe emma wan customers. Niti tu any one wan wo UK say. Obet ni a creative wo tap tap send wallet no, ewa wo app no eso. Se e koba ne se tap tap rate ni ekostra. Obet ni a sebi ska a kodu in pen pen so bi ti se 50,000 Ghana cities. Ane, 50,000 Ghana cities. Na afei, wo yi ni kakran kakran. Se o ba on my gana e mwa. Ube timi a sevi ska ewa o tap tap send wallet na so. Abra unya o how be ya. Na tiye, tap tap send a tre wa ma shimu. Ako dru UAE, Netherland, ena Austria. Tap tap send a na. Eye easy, fast, ena secure. Tap tap send, papa no no. Everybody check now. Check it. Ma check it. Check it, check it. Huh. The beat is real. Don't yeah, yeah, yeah. no make it kill ya. Yeah, yeah. Get your green cell electrocometer and check it. Sugar level, check it, check it. For check it, check it. For check it, for check it, check it, check it. Green cell electrocometer. For check it, for check it, check it, check it. Who sugar level for check it? For check it, check it, check it. For check it, for check it, check it, check it. Reset, go, go, Mika. Everybody check now. This advert has been vetted and approved by the FDA. Abinsoko, massive cash out with Aviator on Parimatch. Charlie, visit parimatch.com.th now and enjoy showdown odds and amazing offers on your favorite sports, jackpot, and casino game. Play with Parimatch and get up to 500% Parry Boost bonus to win big like a boss. Parimatch, the game is yours. This is what's vetted and approved by the Gaming Commission of Ghana. Bet responsibly, no under 80. Gaming can be addictive. There are some stories that when they hit you, you are not able to stand on your feet. You are not able to stand on your feet because you feel so sad about it. And one of such stories um, over the week has come from Nigeria. And as a matter of fact, anybody who is a contributor or a creative person in the entertainment industry will never smile or will never be happy about this story and it is a story that many wished or thought that it never happened but as fate would have it whether we are happy or sad about it it has happened and as it stands now many are wailing weeping many are crying for that misfortune that has happened to a brother uh, many know him on social media as one fine actor many have enjoyed his skits his acting over the years and the fact that he is a lover of the family according to what many are saying that oh he's that guy who is always showing his family playing with his family and all that has even made this whole case heartbreaking it has made it heartbreaking because one um seeing his children young children uh, minors and uh, maybe a young wife coming to start life or coming to continue life with without a father and with i want to use this opportunity to talk about creatives and sometimes what they go through or talent and sometimes what they go through to make others happy sometimes at the peril that's why in the video he mentioned it that hey take your time Oga. I'm not wearing a life jacket. I've left my three children at home. He was warning the people who were riding the boat that this is the problem. This is the situation. Therefore, look at the, uh, the situation and use it to decide. Look at what is happening and use that to decide. Knowing that there is no life jacket. Knowing that I can't swim well. Knowing that where I'm going to, I'm not used to the place. Take your time and decide. But, like I always say, in this our industry, the creative space especially, when you are immersed in the fun, we all forget and ignore the dangers around it. 
Maybe some of us have been lucky over the years. It could be that we've all gone through some of these um, difficult moments or some of these dangers and we're able to come out on head. But that does not mean we were too smart. It doesn't mean we were too skilled. Maybe for God knows how we were saved. But the brother could not go through it. Me riding on the river Niger and listen to this. I felt so terrible. When the first report came that he had died with some videos and photos flying left, right and center. We all thought that, okay, um, as usual, social media is like that. Let's wait for a better confirmation. Then, in, within some few hours, other reports came suggesting that, oh, God has been good. The gentleman is breathing now. That story also went quickly, like wildfire. It was everywhere. Oh, Pope is not dead. Pope is not dead. Pope is not dead. He's alive. He's breathing. Doctors are, uh, are, are attending to him and he's responding to treatment. That story came out and that was also accepted. So many people started jubilating. Then again, when we thought that was all and that at least some hours or some days to come, he would fully recover. Later, we went online, reading news portals, checking around, and another report came confirming that he could not survive it. Where they said they've taken him to about three different hospitals. And all these hospitals have pronounced him dead. In fact, there were some people who have even said that at the time that the incident happened, if there were some medical people on standby or on location, he could have survived. Because, yeah, we understand water. As much as you did not go, you were found, you were picked. The moment you, you fell in, maybe after some mini struggle here and there, if, you were ab if they were able to pick you, of course, you would drink some gallons. That one is fine. We understand when it happens like that, some gallons there, you would drink. Someone who knows how to save people in such a regard will do some small pressing, 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 poof, 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 poof. You'll be coughing all this water away. And if there is a quick treatment for you, you would survive. But unfortunately, because maybe we always work with, oh, nothing will happen, nothing will happen, nothing will happen. It is one of the things that many people always joke with in our industry. Oh, this water that we are going to use to act or we are going to use to work, there is something in it, oh, but you are just going to hold it. Don't drink. Uh -huh. That's how it starts. Oh. There is some, everybody knows there is something in this water. But the scene or the acting or whatever you're going to do suggests that you are just going to hold it. You are not going to drink it. So nothing happened, nothing happened, nothing happened. Uh, before you realize, you've forgotten yourself and you've opened, ba 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 you are drinking. That is when you know that, hey, we've messed up. Nothing will happen. I even, I'm not sure that whilst he was going to do that thing, he signed some insurance form or something. Where now that he's gone, his family and children would enjoy. We are in Africa. Nothing of these sorts are done. We don't do it. It takes me back to when we went to London during the Ghana Music Awards show, UK, Ghana Music Awards UK show, when Shatawale was supposed to climb that thing for his performance, that the organizers insisted that we sign an insurance form and the insurance form was for the good of the artist. That should anything happen to him, should he fall from the, um, from the plate, at least he will be covered with some amount of money, whether injured or not injured. Should he fall? That was it. But do we see the same thing in our African setting? No, we don't. So if you are not careful, you don't do your things right, and you go out of whatever you are doing to entertain people or even yourself, you are done. I saw something from one brother, a film producer. He has been on this platform before, Destiny Omon. And I know many who have been watching this platform, 
might remember him. He's a Nigerian brother, as a matter of fact. And he's a part of the Nigerian um, Nollywood industry, uh, part of the Nigeria's Actors Guild. He said something, and I would want to share that with you. Then to those who have not seen some one or two videos and photos about the death of our brother Pope, you guys will look at it and we are good. At least this is to caution us. All of us that in our daily activities of survival in this space, we have to thread cautiously. We always have to be careful where we go to and what we do there. Else, it will affect us one way or the other. Now, this is what Augustine, uh, Austin Omon Destiny wrote. He says, what a reckless death as in a question of assault. He says, producers may not like what I'm about to say. Producers may not like what I'm about to say. But with my position as head of guild leading actors, directors, crew members, and producers, I dare to say we just gave one of our superstars and able crew members away as Saraka. Sacrifice. He thinks that many will not be happy with what he wants to say. Because it is more or less like coming to expose them. And because he is a part of it, or he's a part of the crew, those who are into that industry. When he speaks like that, it will obviously come out like, yeah, you are come to expose us. But according to him, when he sees the death of the gentleman, he feels like someone has used the gentleman for Saraka. And that is sacrifice in Hausa. Let's continue. He says, as a producer of epic stories, my best locations are forest and sea. There is no movie I shot without a water body location. Of course, I know some of the movies he shot. He, sh he shoots often, then adventure, then typical local stories. So when he says he does more of forest and sea, then it is true. That one I can confirm. At least all his movies, you can see those elements in there. A king without culture. Um, recently he shot some local one. I've forgotten the name of that one. Now let's continue reading. He says, watching the last video... Our brother posted before watching the last video our brother posted before his death. It is obvious that it, it, it is obvious that might be his first time using a boot. None of them was wearing a life jacket. There was no backup. I go on set with at least one certified nurse, not because we don't know how to manage budget, but because the life of our actors and crew matter. That is what he's talking about. That before the death of the guy, Pope. They realized that, based on what his own words were, that no, he wasn't having life jacket and all those things. So indeed, he needed to be protected well. But did we see that? No, we did not see that. He goes ahead to say that even on such occasions, they could have gotten some paramedics around, some caretakers, some lifeguards around them, knowing that they were not having um, um, life jacket on. But once again... Uh, he said maybe the producers and the people who were behind the production felt like, okay, we are saving money. So they did not do that as well. Now let's continue with it. Says, no security, nothing. See how them, they carry our superstar from mortuary to native doctor. So this even tells me that. When maybe they went to the mortuary and they were told that, Oh, the guy is not fully dead and the guy might be breathing and blah, blah, blah. Do you know what they did? They took him to a native doctor. And to people who don't know a native doctor, um, priests, traditional priests, they are the native doctors. Instead of taking him for pure medical care, go to a proper health facility. Unless maybe where they were, there were nothing like that. If there was nothing like that, then that's fair. But even if there was nothing like that, a native doctor, as my Nigerians would say, a native doctor was the drowning link to spirits. Was it the sea god or the river god that took him, that you would take him to the native doctor to treat him? That was a bad approach, as a matter of fact. Let's continue with it. He said, see how they carry a superstar from mortuary to mortuary uh, to native doctor. Some said they were praying, that's why he woke up. Some said they were praying, that's why he woke up. Any nurse would have revived him immediately, but not, but no. Is there any nurse 
would have revived him immediately. But no, they laid him down and was videoing him as if it was a scene in the movie. Mm. On that sad point. Like I said earlier, in such cases, if you have someone who knows how to rescue people in such situations, maybe a life-saving person or any of these guys, they could have saved him because they know how to do it. This one, a, a, a small nurse with a small ex experience could have done this. It is water. He did not keep under the water for so many hours. Just some minutes. Like I said, drink some few gallons, press it somewhere. He will cough, start coughing the water out and we are good. At least something to sustain him till better treatment. But none. There was no security and nothing of that sort happened. Now, it goes ahead to say that. Um, any and was video, I said they were also videoing him when the issue happened, and that is human nature now. When you are going through catastrophe, instead of people to come save you first, no, they would want to keep a video evidence of what you were going through before they would even think about saving you. Yes, we see it. So, you, you are driving, you meet accident scenes, and instead of people helping the accident victim, no, you see them recording. Recently, I saw a video in the US where some cars caught fire. And some people in the car started burning. Some few benevolent people picked those who were burning, ready to give them treatment. There were others, as usual, who were videoing. Yes, we got the video when the fire uh, started in the car. When the car crashed and the fire, we got the video. Are you CNN or BBC? Save humans first and allow CNN and BBC to do their work. Now, it goes on to say that Asaba people will not do well. The last time it was fire, now it is water. Another Mobad, darkness over the skies. I don't know about As Asaba people. I don't know the history or the story about Asaba people and the fact that Austin is linking it to the death of uh, Pope Junior or Junior Pope. I don't know about that. I'm not too sure. But it says Asaba first or the last time it was fire. As in, maybe fire caught some people doing something in the creative arts industry, and now it is water. And it says, another more bad. So many things happen in our space, our creative space, that if you are not careful, you will never understand it. Sometimes if a talent makes some demands, you hear people go like, hey, why is he demanding this? Why is he charging this? Yes. Supposed this guy went out there with some security people who know how to swim. Suppose he went there with some people who were paying attention to some details about his movement. But maybe he could not. Because you ask yourself, oh, how much is he even going to be paid before he will be able to pay the extensions? Because the producers won't do that. They would always not do that. But when some of these celebrities make such demands, they are called names. Some of them are even blacklisted for calling this and that. Some of them are ignored when there are some important decisions to be made because, oh, this guy, he'll come and demand that you give him water with a bottle downstairs. Like so many other things we say about this talent. May his gentle soul rest in perfect peace. This is a very sad one, unfortunately. And maybe some videos for you to watch. And after watching the videos, we will say goodbye to you for being part of this show. This is um, an editorial talking about safety and security of players in the industry. It's insurance for some of these people. Demands to make sure they are fine. And sometimes what people say, this is what I want us to pick from this particular editorial. Special thanks once again to Digital Rasta Currents who did camera for us. Reggie Flex is the editor director of the show, and Tap Tap Send is also here. If you want to send money from abroad to Ghana, use Tap Tap Send. Use their wallet to also save some money. Uh, the Tap Tap wallet will help you to save money. That is money from pounds to cities, and you can always do your expenditure from your wallet. Feel free and um, enjoy it. And um, Parimatch.com, Parimatch betting. We are still inching closer to the Champions League final, and what it means that many people. Uh, enjoying some good wins out of soccer betting. You can bet now. Try parimatch.com or parimatch.gh today and thank me later. We welcome you with some 200% bonus if you use the promo code SAMSP 
or SAM200. If you're able to do that, you'll be given some promo codes. And again, if you want to do Aviator, then SAMAV. With this, you're also good to go. Um, on this note, if you are a talent, it is not all the time that you should think about how you can make the people happy. Ask yourself, how is my safety like in making or in trying to make the people happy? How safe I am? If you are not safe, please save your life and don't do it. Because when you die, the next day they'll move on to the next person. That is what you should know. When you die today, boom, the next day another person will go on the set. So save yourself, save your family from trauma. Pay attention to yourself. In fact, manage yourself first before any other thing. We can end it here. My name is Sammy Flex. May his gentle soul rest in peace to the family, to the Actors Guild, and anybody who believes in the dream of the young gentleman who had died. May they all be um, strengthened in these difficult times. These are trying times for them, and I pray that everybody will be fine. My name is Sammy Flex. Remember to also add your commentaries to this and uh, subscribe to us because we do this for God and country. We out. Bye-bye. I beg, no begs here. Yeah? Yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah. Don't leave me there, bro. No begs. Oh, boy, they love. Don't leave me there, bro. No. Don't leave me there, bro. I got three children. I'm going to raise them. I got three children. I'm going to raise them. <laughs> bro, I beg. Oh, Jesus. What is